The mere thought of baseball is enough to put a spring in your step <laughs> on a February day, isn't it? And baseballs are popping at Brewers training camp. Spring in your step. I see, I see what you did there. That was yep. good. That was good. Today in Arizona, the team held its first full squad workouts, and we got a State of the Brewers update from the owner. Sports director Kevin Holden was there for all of it. He joins us live now from sunny, sunny Phoenix. Hey, Kev. Hey, Jessup and Amanda, Brewers fans have had some regular seasons to remember and a couple of Octobers to forget in recent years. If you're a Brewers fan, it comes with a bit of understanding of the economics of the game of baseball the way they are right now. Josh Hader was traded late 2022, Corbin Burns this past offseason, mostly because they were close to signing big dollar contracts. Mark Adonacio has drawn a little heat for letting some talent leave and depending on younger players, but as the Brewers owner dropped by big league camp today for the first full squad workout, he reminded us. The Brewers have one of the top three records in the National League over the past eight seasons. We made a commitment to always being competitive, and you know that's hard to do when sort of the paradigm is to go all in to win and then rebuild. We're going to continue to try to always compete here. That's it's hard to do that and try to get to a World Series. Adonacio called Brandon Woodruff not just one of his favorite players ever, but one of his favorite people ever. But he did tell us today that that reported deal with Brandon Woodruff for two years is not done yet. So we might have to stay in the sun until we get an answer on that one, guys. Kevin Holden, CBS 58 Sports.